talk about being driven, which is awesome, and I see that, and I also see the not being satisfied, which is great. I've seen a lot of driven people talk about that, which gets them higher, but is there pressure that you place on yourself, not just with the, the YouTube following and the Vine following, but also because you want to do more films, like Along the Roadside mm -hmm. and, and, and TV and things like that. Is there a pressure you feel from yourself? To do what? To, to what? To, to keep getting more roles, to keep, because it's an, an engine that you've got to keep Well, going. yeah, I mean, there's, 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 always, there's always pressure because, A, it's like people don't know what it's like to try to juggle a Vine account and a YouTube account, which is already extremely time, time consuming. Then thinking about how to keep growing your Instagram because you have to post certain times a day and post, post certain things to get more followers. And then on top of that, oh, wait, I have this audition. I have to read lines for it, but wait, oh, I have to shoot a Vine. I have to shoot a YouTube video. Oh, wait, but I have more auditions. So it, it is very taxing. You know, um, it, it takes a lot out of you. And it is, there's a level of pressure. And then it's like, you know, as an actor, you know, you, you're not getting younger, so you want to get more roles faster. And it's like, yeah, there's a lot of pressure. And then how do you deal with it? How do you compartmentalize it? Um, it's always a work in progress trying to compartmentalize it. You know, it's, it's, I don't have it down. I don't have it perfect. Um, but I just continue to build my social networks online and continue to hit auditions. When my, when my manager or my agent sends me auditions, I go into beast mode and I'm focused and I go in there and I know my lines. I go early and I'm just ready to perform and I have a great time auditioning. Um, but, you know, I take it day by day trying to juggle all this because it's like, it's, it's the, the the internet, YouTube and Vine, it's still kind of like the Wild West. You know, it's still undefined. Even though YouTube's been around for a while, Vine's newer. Vine is like the Wild West right now. And like social media is getting into the, the traditional Hollywood world. It's, everything's all mixing up and everything is still new. So I'm still, even at this point, I'm still learning. Do you ever have days where you're not in, in beast mode? Well, of course. Of course. It's, it's hard. Because it's, the difference is when you're, when you're a person like me who's big on social media, you don't work a 9 to 5. It's all on you to push yourself. There's no boss saying you need to be at work at 8 a.m. Unless I have a call time, that's different. But on a day-to-day, -day, when I'm trying to juggle YouTube and Vine and Instagram and auditions, and it's just me, it takes a lot of drive to get yourself up every day and follow a routine without having someone push you. So that's a big challenge sometimes, especially when you, you know, if you live in comfortably and you don't need to get up, it can be a little bit of a challenge, so. <laughs> or oh, unless you have interviews. <laughs>